and welcome back to another video. Today I'll be doing a comparison between these four add-ons. The bee, more bee, feed the bees, more crops, or beetles, and the uh, uh, or golem uh, pets add-on, seeing which one can produce uh, the most diamonds in uh, an hour. So we've got, I've got three bees in here. Um, which might give it a bit of an edge, I don't know, but I've got three bees there. Uh, uh, one of these uh, farm capsules. A uh, all beetle and a single diamond golem sheep. And we'll see which one can produce the most amount of diamonds by the end of this. What I'll probably do with the bee one is, I didn't think about that, but I'll probably just like do two numbers, one for the uh, full one and then just like I'll divide it by three and I'll be like, oh, this will be like how much each individual bee will get. Yeah, anyway. Uh, so, yeah. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to end this recording. I'm going to start up another recording and we're going to we're going to time lapse this. So, yeah. Uh, also, I got a timer on my phone. So, I'm going to start the timer now. So, yeah. And that's in. So, yeah. I'll see you guys in an hour for me, and it'll probably just be like a few minute, a minute or two for you.
It would help if I unmuted everything. Yeah, that, right, so, uh, that's one hour. So here's the results. So the uh, more crops add on, only uh, managed to produce 18 diamonds uh, and you also get 18 seeds in the best farm capsule. Now, that's really bad considering how expensive the seeds are to get in the first place. Um, but uh, you could say, oh, well, you've got some seeds and some diamonds, so you could make another uh, capsule. How, what do you need to cap? Make another capsule, which is eight diamonds and the and the gold capsule set, but it's just like, but then you also have to get the gold capsule, which is eight gold ingots, and, and the regular farm capsule, and regular farm capsule. Capsule has got it looks like fifth like soil, planks, glass and nine ingots, so it's a bit hard to really like justify counting the eighteen diamond seeds as well as that. And then next up we have the all beetles which have produced thirty nine diamonds in an hour and it probably could have produced a bit more but I, you know if I had uh, been more efficient with my uh, harvesting of the Diamonds from the ore beetle, but um, you know, you're a normal person, so you're probably not going to be perfect either. So it's like, yeah, that that is probably just a hole in the bag. The fact that there is no way to really automate the uh collection unless you like get a dispenser. Well, actually, no, not well. I don't a dispenser with a pickaxe and it won't work. So. There's no way to automate it, really. The next up is the uh, gold is the uh, gold and the sheep add-on, which it produced at uh, one stack and thirty-one diamonds uh, from this uh, single sheep in an hour, which is pretty good. And then uh, it's the then the best one is the buzzing is like the feed the bees add-on that produced three stacks and twenty diamonds as well as a bunch of bees right spawning on. We're going to count that with without left over three, so uh, that's probably like uh, if you add an extra one there, that would be yeah, that's basically two dime. Yeah, you get. Hold on, if I just get one more of these real quick. So in the APS table, you convert four of these into two diamonds so that's basically one and a half diamonds there so 21 and a half basically 21 and a half diamonds there uh now if you think that is not fair that there's three beads in there just divide this by three so that's one stack and uh, uh six diamonds or diamonds there switch uh, still puts it above uh, the other two, but just below the uh, golem sheep add-on. But I think that it's not too bad because once you get... Because basically to get the diamond bees, you just need to breed a bunch of bees. So if you have the two bees that you need to make one diamond bee, then you just need to breed... It won't. It's not difficult to get another diamond bee by breeding them again. And then you can grow that to diamond bee up and breed it with the first diamond bee and then you get three then you've got three diamond bees, so I think it's fair having three diamond bees in there. Um but yeah. That's quite interesting. So well so uh I think uh, the farm casuals they need to be buffed. They are just way too slow. Considering one how expensive they are, plus how expensive the seeds are, plus um, the fact that there are other add-ons as we see here that are just better. Like even like the Orbeals one, where it's entirely manual, that beat it out by quite a bit. Like it should, it should have it, it should at least produce one stack every hour. Um, 
Especially considering this is the most expensive one of the four. Um, but yeah, other than that, I don't really have much to say. Because Di the Diamond Bees one, that being the best one, kind of makes sense in my opinion. Because it, it, it while it's not the most expensive looking at you, Farm Capsule, uh, it is the most time intensive. Because with the... Uh, Golem sheep, all you need is to get a diamond or silk touch a diamond or and then uh, put a, a golem head on top of it. I'll just get a golem head and find some diamond or and put that on top of it and then move your, the golem sheep around. Uh, and with the ore beetle, all you need to do is like get find an ore beetle naturally spawn and go to get find some di put it next to some diamond ore and you got to one of them and you can even like bottle them up. Uh, but with this, you do have to do a bit of like a bee tech tree kind of thing and like breed a bunch of bees to get better bees. Um, and uh, yeah. So I hope you guys all did enjoy this video. I hope you uh, found this uh, video informative and helpful. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. Oh, hold on. Bye bye.